one of the most recognisable arenas for the beautiful game in the world. And boy, does it add to the occasion. This is the perfect game for all parties, not least the neutrals who've just come to enjoy it. Well, get ready for some high-grade football, Peter. Two strong teams, as you say, full of wonderful individual talent. And we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football. As to whether we'll see a high-scoring contest, that's a little harder to predict. I'm not complaining, though, because there are good players. There's the whistle. Who do you, Jim, see making the difference here? Yeah, Gabriel Jesus, he's always going to be a massive threat, Peter. And that's primarily because his movement off the ball is so effective. Even if he doesn't end up touching the ball, he usually plays a part in his team's attacking plays because he's dragged people out of position. And that can be an obvious help to those around him. He's uh, full of enthusiasm. Hard to disagree with that. It is the sort of situation he thrives in. Vinicius Junior. Saka. Hoist it forward. And the through ball is intercepted. Plays it out to the flank. Ah, oh, he'd have done well to reach that. The other side, especially adventurous early on. Sinchenko cuts it out. Midway through the first half, and there's an impotence about this game that's causing me concern, and, and probably most of the stadium too. Let's just hope that by the end, it'll have been forgotten. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Beautifully done. Delivers a cross. And a header! He's done well to get his head on that, but couldn't score. Arsenal can defend those situations better by stopping the crosser at source. Zinchenko. Oh, sweet feet. And he's... Gabriel Jesus! He's pulled off a fine save. Gabriel Jesus simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Alaba. Some good work on the right flank. Now, what's next? And it's got through. Oh, that's nice. Can he deliver? Nicely controlled. Whipped in. Great leap! Gorgeous control there. Vinicius Junior. Floats one over. Gabriel Jesus with good energy in defence as well. I think it's great to see that kind of... And the finish! <laughs> nice to get it forward quickly. Zinchenko. It's Gabriel Jesus!
still not really a true reflection of what's been uh, a pretty open game. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Gabriel Jesus. Gets good distance on it. And that's been one straight back. Chance! That has certainly tested the keeper. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Has a hit! He scored! Arsenal take the lead! The lightness of step, the sharpness of movement, the certainty of finish. Well, none of us were exactly sure how that was going to end up then, but I'm delighted to see such a, a happy ending after such a splendid dribbling run. I mean, he really did fool that defence into wondering what he was going to do next. Arsenal take the lead. And we've reached half time. So there you have it, a close fought half of football. But London still had its moments. It ultimately produced just one goal. A more than decent game up to now. As always, an early goal would help sweep things back in their favour. And the second half gets underway. Real Madrid don't need to press the panic button just yet. They may have to tweak their, their setup first if they don't grab an early goal in this second half. They can't hold back though. Gets it upfield. Alaba does well there. Alert. Rice. Saka. Back into the middle. Big chance! <laughs> That's a... Has a pop! And the keeper barely had to move. Very speculative with little threat, if any. For the keeper, Gabriel Jesus in with the challenge. Yeah, he was under pressure to get that exactly right, and he couldn't even think of the consequences. It was instinctive and rock solid. Gets the better of his man, Vinicius. Vinicius Junior. Great effort, beautifully taken. Ah, that's a great effort. There was very little backlift to indicate what was coming. Vinicius Junior. <laughs> Tries to stroke it through. Sinchenko gets it away. The ball has crossed the line, and it's a throw. Poor throw that, picked off with relative ease. Saka pushes to get on the end of it. So, Jim, what are you thinking? Well, the time has arrived to start taking risks. They may well be happy just to level this. Played into the middle. Deflected behind for a corner kick.
and it's been taken short. So who's he picking out? Rice. Could be a chance here. Oh, shooting chance! Oh, great save, real class. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Arsenal really are almost trying to pass the ball through a brick wall at the moment. You can see the sense of anxiety has, has now shifted to the stands. Across the field it goes. Saka, and it's played forward. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Modric goes looking. Keep calm and carry on. That's the job in a nutshell now. He's been bundled over. That is a foul. Well, I think the alternative was to stand there and, and do nothing while he, he tried to score. And obviously, he's not going to allow that, Peter, is he? He's gone for it! That is gorgeous! About as smooth as it gets! Two up now, and they are cruising! Dispatched expertly, nicely done. So that's two now without reply. Vinicius Junior. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Rice. Real Madrid can admit to being second best so far. They've not looked together enough and concentration levels are well down on the standard we expect. Zinchenko. Sit into the middle. And again, they run up against stubborn defending. He's got options in the box if he gets his head up. And he's there to cut it out. Forward it goes. A real chance to break. Caballos. Driving on now, what can they conjure from here? Breaks on here. Oh, good interception. Modric. Tony Kroos. Time added on will be two minutes. And that's that. Oh, this hurts. The pain of defeat, very evident. And there are hard lessons to be learned from it all when they regroup. Your reflections then, Jim. Real Madrid could still be playing, Peter, and probably still be...